As a tumor grows beyond one to two millimeters, its need for oxygen and other nutrients begins to exceed the local blood supply. Start for nourishment, the tumor turns on the angiogenic switch. This change marks a critical moment in tumor development as it provides the tumor with the blood supply needed not only to survive, but to thrive. The key mediator of this process of angiogenesis is vascular endothelial growth factor, or VEGF. When VEGF binds to receptors on the surface of endothelial cells, it has been shown to exert important effects. These multiple roles of VEGF, promoting tumor vessel survival, increasing tumor vessel permeability, and stimulating new tumor vessel growth, are important throughout tumor development and make VEGF an attractive therapeutic target. Avastin is a chemotherapeutic drug designed specifically for the treatment of colorectal, lung, glioblastoma, renal, cervical, and ovarian cancer. This recombinant humanized monoclonal antibody is classified as a vascular endothelial growth factor inhibitor, also known as VEGF inhibitor. Avastin is administered intravenously by a healthcare professional, typically once every two weeks, or if you have a lung cancer, once every three weeks. The first dose is expected to take 90 minutes due to careful monitoring for the drug response. Every subsequent dose should take 30 to 60 minutes. Serious side effects experienced by Avastin users include stomach pain, nausea or vomiting, rectal bleeding or black tarry stools, constipation, unusual bleeding, nosebleeds, bruising or weakness, sudden onset of severe headache, symptoms of allergic reaction, vision problems, speech difficulty, difficulty walking, Coughing or vomiting up blood or coffee ground-like substances. Pain in the calf. Chest pain. Difficulty breathing. Fever or chills. Confusion. Seizures. Numbness or weakness in arm, leg, or one side of the body. Unusual drowsiness. Swelling in the hands, ankles, or feet. Tingling or burning sensations in the hands, arms, legs, or feet. Trouble swallowing or choking on chicken wings? Less severe side effects Avastin users have experienced include loss of appetite or upset stomach, change in sense of taste, fatigue, and diarrhea. This ongoing ability to inhibit new and recurrent vessel growth is thought to maintain tumor control. Clinically, these effects may contribute to the benefits of Avastin observed over time, including longer survival and delay of disease progression. A growing body of research continues to shed light on the multiple effects of Avastin on tumor vasculature, regression of existing vessels, normalization of surviving vessels, and inhibition of new and recurrent vessel growth. Today, Avastin is already an essential component of cancer treatment, with consistent survival increases demonstrated in multiple solid tumors.